squirrels are often referred to as slow, but sloths are slightly slower. It's an animal that's getting a lot of attention these days. So we went to the St. Louis Zoo to learn more about this cute creature. They've sort of slowly crept into pop culture. A worm. Like a, a dagger. Uh, tiny sword. Stealing scenes and commercials and sending celebs oh, into complete song. meltdowns. There one is. I'm so sad that one's coming to your <laughs> It's no wonder. I mean, sloths are pretty darn cute, and the St. Louis Zoo is home to two of them. Blondie hangs around in the primate house. Camden is the one often curled up in the children's zoo. He's the two-toed sloth you can actually get pretty close to on a behind-the-scenes tour. The tours come in the kitchen. We can kind of explain what the diet's made of. Shannon Santangelo is one of the zookeepers who gets to admire the five-year-old often. Pretty unique because because they spend most of their life in an upside down position, even their organs are kind of placed a little differently than other mammals. That also means she has keys into his habitat and knows more about the little guy than most like his favorite foods. Um, I found that he likes pear a lot. So, um, Which comes in handy when it's your turn to feed him. How about a grape? But like us, it depends on the day, and today he's more into red peppers and downright sloppy with apples. So because their diet is largely just leaves, plants, twigs, you know, fruits in the wild that don't have a lot of nutritional value to them, that doesn't give them a lot of energy when they digest it. Hence their unbelievable lack of speed. We're talking a top speed of six and a half feet per minute. They could take up to a month to digest some of the, the items that they eat. They are fascinating creatures, adorable animals that remind us that life shouldn't be rushed. I mean, how cute is that face? The sloth slow down tours can have up to four people, but you do need to be at least eight years old. As you can imagine, it's a popular tour and already booked for the next couple of months. You can learn more at stlzoo.org slash tours. Now you can also adopt a sloth for Valentine's Day. Now obviously there isn't time to have the package delivered by Wednesday, but you can swing by the zoo's welcome desk. It's a great package. You get a little plush toy, an adoption certificate, a fun photo with animal facts and a couple of other things. It's $50 and all proceeds go to the care and feeding of the animals. Val